Oh, and what about that plan he had to defeat ISIS? We're That's fighting a very politically correct war. Yeah. Well, we see that and happening the other thing is with the terrorists, you have to take out their families. When you get these terrorists, you have to take out their families. They, they care about their lives. Don't kid yourself. Mr. But they Trump. say they don't care about their lives. You have to take out their families. That is the front-runner for the Republican nomination advocating a war crime. And he might say he was joking or he's changed his mind about any of these things. And private individuals are allowed to change their minds. We all do it. But when he's sworn in as president on January 20th, 2017, on that day, his opinions are going to matter. And you will remember that date, because it's the one that time travellers from the future will come back to to try and stop the whole thing <laughs> from happening. And listen, I get... I get that the character of Donald Trump is entertaining and that he says things that people want to hear. And I know his very name is powerful. There is. Because it turns out the name Trump was not always his family's name. One biographer found that a prescient ancestor had changed it from, and this is true, Drumpf. Yes. <laughs> King Drumpf. And Drumpf is much less magical. It's the sound produced when a morbidly obese pigeon flies into the window of a foreclosed Old Navy. Drunk! It's the sound of a bottle of store-brand root beer falling off the shelf in a gas station mini-mart.